Hey all, what's up? It's your girl Lorianne. Today we're going to be doing an unboxing. We are doing the unboxing of Sony's digital camera ZV-1. So here is the camera guys, it comes in this small little box. You can get this at Lazada and the camera is just $14,999 but if you get it with a grip, it's $45,999 which I think is super worth it because it doesn't matter which one you get, if you just get this or if you get both. They come with a 64GB SD card which is like, dang. It also has 3 years warranty even if you get it off of Lazada. So let's finally open the box. I already opened it up, but this is the 64 gigabyte SD card, which is already inside the camera. Your warranty card, your user manual, and of course the camera wrapped in bubble wrap. Here is the windshield, you can attach it to the hot shoe, and a USB to micro USB cable. Next for the shooting grip, it comes with the actual grip with a cable that plugs right into the camera. You have a hand strap and a pouch. This is what the grip looks like. You hook this into your camera like that so you can go even adjust the um, zooming in and zooming out with just the buttons here and then the photo and movie button. So while you are shooting like this, you can click to start recording or click to take a photo. This one also folds out to become like a tripod. Oh, the right? So you can set it on your desk and take a video. Here's the pouch and the hand strap is also inside and the user manual. But this is what I'm so excited for, guys. It's the Sony's digital camera ZV-1. So let's take a closer look at this camera. Man and Sham grip on the side here so that it's easy to hold it vertically or horizontally or when you're taking a selfie. The buttons on top, especially right here for the photo and the video are big. There's a mode button and on and off. Here's how it looks on the back. You can actually unfold it like this and turn on the camera by just opening it up. You can also turn off that option if you don't like. This is called a very angle LCD screen because it has various angles. So you can shoot like this, you can turn it if you're shooting overhead so that you can see your screen. You can also flip it towards you. Or you can just fold it like that on the back. Mas malaki din yung recording lap nila so that when you click recording, it lights up so you know it's recording because you know, you're like, am I recording? Perfect that I got for casual video shooting. So what's that mean? The casual videography is like, 15 to 60 second clips, but anything under a minute. And ganun din naman ako eh, sa mga one minute vlogs ko, I really try to make everything fit in one minute. So this is the perfect camera for me. I'm sure you're a mobile phone user, especially when you want to take your videos, pero kung gusto mo mag upgrade, perfect for you guys, because this is like made for mobile phone users. So why is that? Wala siyang complicated settings, guys. Very straightforward siya. If you want to do certain things, as in push of a button lang, and they make it happen. I know some of us are in the phone, natin, but you know how sometimes you get phone calls, notifications, wala ka lang space sa phone, uh, the quality is not that good, lag siya nage in and out of focus, it just doesn't do what you want. Oh girl, look no further. So usually when it comes to shooting, these are our problems. But here are the highlights of the ZV-1. So throughout this video guys, I'm going to be giving you my little review and I will highlight the features that I super love in this and show you some sample clips as well. So the ZV-1 has a fast hybrid autofocus and a real-time eye autofocus, so what's that mean? You know when you're shooting something and you move back and forth in the frame, like in and out of focus shot? The autofocus is so good. It has a real-time eye tracker, like this. There's a little box on the screen that makes sure it's always focused on face small. Because the really pet peeve go when shooting videos is like when I'm out of focus! <sighs> so check out the sample clip. We're now trying the fast hybrid autofocus and the real-time eye autofocus. On my screen, I can actually see a little square over my eye. So I should be in focus even if I'm super close or moving super far. So imagine if I was like talking to you guys and I want to like shoot a TikTok. Da, da, da. I should still be in focus even if I'm close, even if I'm far. But I think that's what's so cool about this is that no matter where I move, no matter how far or how close, 
it keeps me in focus. Wow. So it was super good. Doesn't matter where I moved on the screen. I was still in focus. I right? super magulo ako. <laughs> Next up, this camera has optimized brightness and color. So you don't need to worry anymore if it's really dull yung skin mo or if it's really dark on your face. This camera automatically adjusts those settings. And the bummin tan guys when we're taking photos or videos, we're always like, I we're against the light. We need to find the light. Now with this, this one really gives priority to your face so that even if you go from like super bright to super dark, it still gives priority so that it sees your beautiful face. And lastly, they also have a soft skin effect. So if you don't feel like you're having the best skin day or if you just want to look super snatched, and you have a setting for that. And it can be turned off or set on low, medium, or high. I think it's automatically set to medium, and which actually looks really natural. I'm like, whoa, look at her skin though. Especially when you're in a rush, you buy mong i edit yung video na yan. You just click the video and you look at fresh. So check out this sample video. Just looking at it on the screen, my skin tone looks really good, really soft and natural color as well. So I'm gonna go to a bright area of my room. It's keeping my face and skin and everything looking great. But what if it goes dark? There's, I see it brightening up my face even though it went dark. So I don't really have to adjust so much. I don't have to be like where the light is. Even if it's kind of dark, you can still see my face. Next up that is super important to me, especially as someone who likes to walk around and take videos, <laughs> is really image stabilization. So this has steady shot active mode. So even when you're walking, you don't see that in the video. Okay, so imagine you're taking your video or you're shooting it like that and you're walking. Sometimes you'll see the jiggle in the video, but this one grabbing mukhang smooth. Mukhang naka gimbal shot without a gimbal. I'm actually gonna show you a sample video. We are now going to try the image stabilization. As you can see, naka grip siya, but I shouldn't be seeing any movement as I walk. So here I am just walking around my room. Wow, look at that. The camera movement is so smooth, even though I'm stepping. What if we try jumping again, okay? Jump, then on. Is it still shaky? Wow, he not shaky though. That's kind of crazy. So I can freely move around like this. It's not hilo, diba? So even if I spin like this, ah! <laughs> it should be stable. <laughs> I think it's so cool, it's crazy that even if I was walking and jumping around, very stable but in sha. So if you have shaky hands like me, then this is perfect. Next up with this, especially if you like to shoot little video clips with audio, then it has clear audio and microphone recording. It's also great for recording audio because it comes with a dead cat or a wind screen or a little fluffy. So what this does is it reduces the wind noise and it's made to fit in this camera already. So let me attach it. You just pull out this part on the hot shoe and you slide this in and it automatically covers the microphone that's underneath it. So it's the mic and there. We just pop that in and if you were to blow on it or if it's windy outside, it won't pick up a lot of the wind noise. But what's also good is if you have external microphone that you want to use, then you can actually hook it up onto the hot shoe here at Men and Chunk, microphone jack on the side of the camera. So I'll show you guys a sample clip of me kind of like talking in front of a fan and just like in a quiet area or with air gone to see and test the microphone audio. Okay, so here's the test audio. I just have my fan on and the windshield is not on. Okay, now I put on the windshield. I'm gonna stand in front of my fan. Now in front of my fan, as in the wind is directly blowing on the fan. So I don't know it's not too loud. So here it is in front of the fan with the windshield. And this is far away from the fan. And it sounds pretty nice and clear. Next up on this camera, which I was like, super mind blown about is yung mga one push or one touch functions. There are actually two that I want to talk about. One is the bokeh switch. I'm sure you guys have heard of bokeh or parang portrait mode where it makes the subject um, clear in the foreground and then yung background niya parang nagbabokeh or nagbablur or out of focus siya. So can you imagine, you don't need to know anything about camera settings, you don't need the ISO, f-stop, shutter speed, like, girl, remove that from your mind because this camera makes it easy for you. As in, one touch lang and you're already the background. Mo. So, one click and the 
camera automatically adjusts for you. Sana all naga adjust, di ba? Buti pa yung camera naga adjust. <laughs> so I'll show you a sample clip of this. Right now, hindi na ko on yung bokeh, but I can turn it on with just a click of a button. So that should make my background a little bit out of focus like this. Ayan, mas out of focus na siya, and more focus is on me on the subject or target. So I'll turn it off. And naging mas klaro yung background ko. Turn it on. And it's out of focus. So I can also do it if I want to show off a product. So here it is. It's like shooting normally. And let's try it with the bokeh mode. Ta -da! And now parang naging mas focused yung product and the background is out of focus. One more time. Turn it off. And now it's a bit clearer. You can see that the other controller became clear. And if I turn on the bokeh mode, it's out of focus. So cool. So if you want to like quickly highlight a product, you could be like, walking like, hey guys, oh my gosh, you should check this out. Da -da -da. Turn on the bokeh mode. And it looks great. And secondly is the product showcase setting. So I'm sure you guys are familiar with, with this. Hey guys, I want to show you guys my newest camera. It is the Sony Digital Camera ZV-1. Baka hindi siya nagpo-focus. Ayun, ayun, nagpo-focus na siya. Girl, wala lang ganyan. Wala na. I'm sure we've seen a lot of vloggers put their hand to the screen and then like have their, say, their lipstick or eyeliner or whatever they're showing off like that. This is so that the camera focuses on a bigger area and on the product and then you pull your hand away so that it's in focus. Sis, you have, you have no idea how many times it's been my problem. But when you turn on this product showcase setting, Wow! I'm gonna try it guys and I want you to see the sample clip. So I just turned on the product showcase setting. So that means when I pull up an item close to the camera, it should focus all the way. So let's try this makeup palette. It's it parang it focused to this so quickly and then when I took it down the focus on the face Let's try that again. I'll open the palette naman. Like I wanna show you guys my favorite shade. And yeah, grab it. That is so fast. That's crazy. I've never seen a camera do that. So again, let's try it. Let's challenge it. Let's try it with something thinner, like eyebrow pencil. Okay, like okay. So this is my favorite shade, Gunner. What? <laughs> That's crazy. That's not even the end. Like normally, I'll have to go like this so that you can see it. But even if I hold it up really close like that, it will detect my product sa hat niya and automatically focuses on it, and then focuses right on my face, and I'm done. <sighs> Insane! <gasps> it's so fast! <laughs> if you saw that clip, super insane shot. So you could see that, like I was sitting there showing you my products, and then all of a sudden it would. It would focus on the product when I put the product down. Focus sa agad sa akin. I didn't even realize na ginagawa ko yun lage and yun yung problem ko all the time. Only for it to be solved with a push of a button. Next up, with this camera, you can actually remotely shoot from your phone. Sometimes it's actually easy to hook it up to your phone. So meron silang app. It's called the Imaging Edge app or Imaging Edge Mobile. So all you have to do is connect your camera to your phone. And then the screen and settings of the camera mama could pop up on the phone. Mo. So if you want to like take a photo, take a video, if you want to adjust the settings, the brightness, if you want to zoom in, zoom out, kaya na ng app na to. And some extra things that I want to note is that this camera shoots 4K. So kung, you know, professional ka, if you want that 4K quality, then you can get this camera too. Also, what I find super cool is what I always do para sa mga hangry management videos ko is lagi ako nagshoot ng vertical pang IGTV or IG stories. But when you shoot vertical with this, yung video file niya exports as a vertical video. So if you were to transfer your files from your camera to your phone wirelessly, you don't have to worry about rotating, editing, as in wala na yan, guys. You can just instantly get it vertical already. And lastly, there is interval shooting or time lapse. So if you wanted to like record, you know, a time lapse of the stars or of like the sunset, you could do that as well. So that's it for some of the highlights of this camera, guys. In fairness, I just got it recently, pero grab na tutuwa talaga ako. I've been enjoying it so much kasi na fit talaga siya sa lifestyle ko because I don't think a lot of long form videos for me. Like I like quick, easy videos that don't require much effort. 
And this is what I love about the ZV-1 is na it makes sense without it being complicated. Ganon dapat ang pagibig, hindi dapat complicated. That's why I love this <laughs> because it doesn't stress me out. I just know that when I turn it on, it will do exactly what I want it to do. So yeah guys, if you are interested in more casual videography and bringing your videos to the next level, you can go and check out Sony's digital camera ZV-1. I'm super in love with this and I know you guys will fall in love with it too. This is available on Lazada so make sure to go and check it out. The link is in the description below and also in the pinned comment. And that's it for today's video guys. I hope you and Make sure to go and subscribe, give it a like, and hit the little bell button down below so you can notify you every time I have a video. That's it for me, your girl Oriana, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!